in the Irma Ream. Hello guys, welcome to the Dara Education Project video tutorial series for the PHP and in this session number 4 we are going to learn how to create the database and the tables in the PHP My Admin. So first of all you need to uh, view that your WAMP server is working properly. If your WAMP server is working properly then you will just need to add a local host on your computer. Remember that local host is only working on your computer so if if this uh, is working fine then this page will be appear on your screen after that you will click on the php my admin and uh, php my admin will provide this page for you after that first of all you need to create a database and you will just click on this database i am creating a student a college database you can say college database uh, it's a case uh, sensitive language so it doesn't matter that whatever you are writing here it will be in the small letters college database after that you will just click on the college database and add the name of the table student table and uh, table and provide the number of columns it will be five because we are taking the form of the five elements I am going to uh, take the name variable character it will be 50 and if you want to get the just just for id and it will be up uh, to increment it then remember it will be integer and no length will be provided here you will select auto increment and here you will use uh, auto increment and it will be a primary key for your computer after that you will add name variable character it will be 50 and uh, father name variable character 50 50 is enough for these variables and after that address variable character it will be 100 and email variable 50 we are short of one very one column and if you want to add more columns after adding this just add it one column and go add one more column and it will be created here and uh, here I will use the phone number and it will be 10 because I think it's 15 it will be okay after that you just go and save this file this will create the table and you can create as many table as you can in one database and the same process will be applied for the all the things thank you very much for watching this tutorial and Allah Hafiz